a uh, suspect being reported as a person with a long gun. It's a fast-paced news market, but Dennis Prosco is not only able to keep up, but often first on scene and on air, like he was the day a mass shooting broke out at a New York hospital on June 30th, 2017. A lot of times we're like the fire truck that gets sent to a scene, so we're the first called. A lot of times we're the first there. Prosco has worked for Helicopters Incorporated for 10 years and reports and runs the camera for WNBC TV 4 New York. Never thought, you know, that I would actually be on television and be able to fly an aircraft. Two things that I always dreamed about, but never put the two together. I've got the best job in the world. Dennis's expertise in breaking news coverage earned him his second Emmy covering a deadly ISIS terror attack in Lower Manhattan. As we pull up, I'm looking at it for the first time, and it's just go time. You just go into it. With more than 22,000 flight hours, Dennis has covered everything imaginable, including being part of a news story when he captured this oh, yeah, blinding okay. laser that lit up the cockpit. I see the people involved right now. They're walking in and out of the building. It's unfortunate because people get in big trouble doing this, and I don't think that they really know the ramifications of how dangerous it is to the crews that are up in the air. Dennis was instrumental in designing a number of cutting-edge innovations, including real-time graphic mapping video overlays that other news markets across the country now use. And I quickly found out that if our equipment broke, I wasn't flying. So I kind of learned really quick how to start troubleshooting some problems, fixing some problems. This Bell 407 is by far the most capable, flexible, and advanced ENG chopper flying today. Another powerful tool keeping Helicopters Incorporated employees above the rest.